Approximately 60,000 Americans are diagnosed with Parkinson's disease each year, and more than 10 million people are living with the disease worldwide. Reporter Destiny Wiggins gives us the details on what a local support group does for those who are affected. Parkinson's support group Sanford Bemidji is an informal group that allows people with Parkinson's, their caregivers, family and friends to come and talk about their personal experience. Well, I got some good information about good websites to go to to look up information about Parkinson's and then some individuals gave uh, their experience with their Parkinson's disease and uh, I was not aware of all of the details of that. Common symptoms of the disease include tremor, which is a shaking beginning in the limbs, trouble moving or walking, muscle stiffness, body posture and more. Of course, we're all hoping for a cure, but it's still unknown as to what causes it. So until they know what causes it, it's almost impossible to cure it. So most of the research now is done to figure out ways to treat the symptoms. Today's meeting featured a guest speaker named Cole McLean, a student at North Dakota State University, who finds joy in speaking with patients and their caregivers to answer questions about their disease. Day to day, most people probably doesn't affect them a whole lot, but for people that are affected by the disease, um, things like this, especially the support group, you know, with people involved in it, it can help them a lot. The purpose of the support groups is to let those dealing with Parkinson's know that they are not alone. Members are allowed to share their specific challenges without judgment, and in return are gifted with insight, information, and love. Reporting in Bemidji, Destiny Wiggins, Lakeland News. The group meets every third Tuesday of the month at 1.30 in the Windsong Building at the Woods Edge Senior Living Campus. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.